So in Gary's Mod, we've seen a lot of useless things. Things that you probably don't need, and some that you're probably better off without. But even the most useless of mods are useful in some way. In fact, I did a video on mods that were all useless, but were still pretty cool to use anyway. I'll put that video in the top right corner. And today we have something within that same vein. This is the RNG gun. Now first things first guys, I want to say that if I do sound a bit different or if things just sound weird or look different, definitely let me know because I ended up reinstalling my entire computer. So all my settings I had to redo from scratch, but thankfully I do remember most of it. And it, it's going to be an interesting day, that's for sure. Now back to the gun. What does it do? Well, pressing left click, you shoot out a prop. Now, as you probably can guess by the name of the weapon, it is going to be random. I don't even know what the hell that was I just shot. It's also hard to say if this does pull things from your downloaded mods. It could just be from stuff that's already in the game. Okay, is this from TF2? So we have all the things from TF2 apparently. And also hear this. I'm just gonna be quiet for a second. Stop that. Did that door just make a noise? And not only did it make a noise, I think it tried talking to us. So for some reason, every time you shoot. Reload. Oh, I get it now. That's part of the RNG. Do I even want to know what textures are supposed to be on this? So the RNG also applies to the gun sound. You know when you shoot guns like say the SMG, it makes a, well, signature sound. And even the sounds of the weapon firing are also RNG. I'm sorry. Oh, well that was depressing. Obviously that was Mossman when you get up to the Citadel. God damn man, that just brings me back so much good memories. Oh, I don't even know what we shot. Oh, whatever this thing is. Now, the thing that makes this interesting is it not only shoots random things, but it also applies random properties. For instance, okay, I have no clue what that was, but this is like an airport caddy. What? The <laughs> All right, this must be from Counter-Strike or something, but I think what it can do as well, wait, that's a piece of a broken cup. All right, so yes, I was correct. It does pull from the games you have installed, but also the mods you have downloaded. So nothing is off limits. It also does a few unique things that I'm going to go over right now. <clears throat> It'll randomly size scale whatever item it shoots. So you don't know what size the item's gonna be when you fire. You also have a random chance of the object you shoot being on fire. And then something else is you get random glow effects. I don't even... Oh, oh, there it is! We got the random glow effect! And this is the really fun one, get this. Random damage. Which means we could theoretically shoot a box or a cone that does like 10 billion damage or something. In fact, let's go ahead and test it out. Okay, that is one hard trash bag. You know the weird thing though? That's not the first time we had that. Um, I think we shot one out here somewhere, so... What are the odds that of all the models that are in this game that we got two of the same one? Oh, we killed him with a piece of paper. Wait, what? How did you? Oh, <laughs> so it looks like it'll even apply a random material as well. Okay, guys, <clears throat> I can't believe this. There's a 1% chance it'll spawn a random NPC. I'm going to have to go back and post and check this out. There is no way that we got that 1% chance and it spawned Odessa out of all the NPCs. That would be too scary of a coincidence to fathom, but let's go ahead and just keep shooting this because honestly, as the name suggests, you don't know what you're going to get. It really is going to be random. And how come he is not dying? But yeah, think of anything possibly random, things that glow for no reason, things that have trails, things that have textures that aren't supposed to be there. There is nothing off limits. All right, let's just keep shooting, guys. I don't know what we're gonna get. I'm just gonna shoot until there's absolutely nothing left to shoot. Oh, wait, who is that? Huh. Hey, what's going on, have... All right, I'm just gonna leave him alone. Now, this would be a weapon that would be really fun to mess around with your friends, just shooting out random things and figuring out what you get. I mean, I don't know about you guys, but I've always wanted a purple mattress. Oh, <laughs> we hit Odessa right in the face. I don't even know with what. Is this supposed to be a flashlight? Not knowing what you're going to get, it is just really exciting. I'm so glad that the creator added so much more. 
Because I'm going to be honest with you guys, I didn't know all this stuff was in the weapon. I just wanted to be surprised and show you guys my reaction. And this is what pretty much we got. So I didn't know it would change the properties of these items. I didn't know it would change the sounds. It would add cool effects. Or all the other weird random stuff. Now, there is a right click, but it doesn't seem to do anything. So... Here. Yourself up. Oh, thanks, bro. Now, sometimes the props won't always go the way you expect, although that poor guy got a giant vending machine to the face. But you're gonna notice that when you shoot, so. Oh. Sometimes the object is gonna shoot to the left. I think that's another thing with the randomness. It's not even going to shoot straight all the time, so. If there's anything even remotely random, this weapon has it. Could even be the most random weapon ever. I love the creepy G-Man voice lines. That's just my favorite. I'm just going to be quiet, though, and let you guys listen to the amazingness. Alright, um, what the hell is that? I don't even know what that is. I thought that was like the claw from the Doom weapons, but I don't think I have anything installed but these mods, so... This is the crazy thing about this weapon is I'm showing you the base model. I mean, I do have a lot of Source games installed, so that is one thing, but even if you just have Gary's mod installed, you're gonna be getting a lot of interesting things, like this rainbow smoke. But if you have add-ons installed, it's going to be even more ridiculous, and I can't even think of the crazy things that could spawn. Who the hell is this guy? But that really is pretty much it, guys. This was a mini mod showcase, and a really fun video to just showcase. I'm gonna be honest, I did not know what to expect, and this definitely did not disappoint. So let me know what's the craziest thing you guys spawned in. We actually did spawn this in again, but I would love to hear what you got in the comment section down below. As always though, links will be in the description. And if you guys like this video, you can leave a like, subscribe. Thank you all so much for watching this until the end, and until next time, farewell.